How important is having a family for you? It's very important. I, th I mean, I think, I think what else is, for me, it's like that's the reason I'm here. So, but is it, is it imminent? Is that your? Well, what about uh, Cindy and Richard's family? Um, yeah, that, I mean, that's why we got married. So, but I, I mean, I, want, I don't feel it's unreasonable to be, like the second we got married, everyone was like, so, so, so. And the thing is, is I don't think it's that uncommon to want to be married for a year or two before all of a sudden you make another change and have a baby and I mean your life keeps changing and changing and changing. Someone said to me the other day, well, you know, when do you plan to stop modeling? And to me modeling is being in front of a camera. And so even if I'm not modeling for a job, my life is still going to be, I, I can't imagine a day in the next 10 years that I won't ever be taking pictures or being in front of a camera. You know, even if it's for MTV, I'm in front of a camera. So I, I see being in front of a camera as part of my life for the next, I don't know, maybe 10 years or so. Um, and you know, snapshots are fine. How's marriage going? You, you enjoying it? Yeah, it's, it's actually, it's not that much. I thought it was going to be more different. Like I think a lot of times women think, okay, well, <coughs> when I graduate from school, my life's going to start. Or when I get a, my move away and get my first big job, my life's going to start. And uh, for me, it was like, when I get married, my life's going to start. And then I got married, and it was great, but wasn't that different? And I realized, oh my God, my life started 20 years ago, and I didn't even know it 27 years ago, to be exact. And um, so I guess for me, the big realization of being married is that it's, it's not that much different. Like, I, I still have to make myself happy. And I know everyone says that, but when you experience it for yourself, it's totally, you know, it's a different thing. You know, one of the main things I've seen about you over the last few years, and it's not the look thing, it's that you are a very savvy business person. Do you think most people are surprised or intimidated by your, your smarts? I don't think that, um, first of all, I don't really see myself as like this brilliant business person, but I see myself as someone who knows what I want and I've been around long enough to not get pushed around as much as a young model would, a young person. So um, I think that that sometimes people are surprised that I am as firm as I am. But I think the myth that models are really stupid is, is hopefully fading. I mean, I don't, I don't run into that all the time, like, oh, really, you can, you can talk in more than one syllable words? I don't, I don't meet people like that very often. And if I do, I don't really care to um, continue the relationship. <laughs> so I, I don't have that problem, really. Do you um, have a fantasy of what you would like to see yourself doing 10 years from now? The perfect fantasy, it all worked the way you wanted. Family, career, how I don't have one right now. I really don't have a fantasy for what 10 years from now would be. Um, I mean, I want to be happy. I'd like to have a family. But career-wise, I want to do something that excites me and I'm passionate about. And I feel like that changes so much. 